and welcome to Let's Get Real About Makeup and it's where I do makeup reviews for the over 60s with me Julie Lewis and today we are looking at Beauty Pie a tinted down moisturiser. So I'm going to get sort of straight on with the application of this and it's the Beauty Pie Sheer Tinted Oil Free SPF 20 and this is in shade light. Now it comes in eight shades going from very fair down to deep dark and as I say this is the light shade that I'm using. I'm going to get straight on to the application and then I'll just start talk about it as we're going along. So I've just like sort of squeezed a little bit out there and uh, it does say on the instructions on how to use is actually just to uh, put it over your favourite moisturiser on the morning. Now I'm currently using all Beauty Pie skincare products or the cleansers, you know, the moisturisers, uh, everything and I'm really loving them. I'll go more into what Beauty Pie is and how you how you buy on the website but I've put a little bit on there and it's a th it's a thicker consistency than what I thought it was going to be actually when I used it yesterday I did like a I did like a squirt a pro um and I put I put too much on so I'm going to put this like sort of straight onto my skin and uh I'm just going to tap that in now you could use a brush for this if you wanted to I'm just using my fingers um, this is really lovely. Um, if it's your first time of watching, I've got um, oily combination skin. I've got uh, acne scarring from having acne when I was in my teenage years. I've got rosacea. I've got broken capillaries. Uh, what else? I've got open pores. Uh, did I say oily combination skin? I don't know. And um, uh, mature skin, because I'm 63. It was my birthday uh, in March. So I'm just going to read what it says on Beauty Pie's uh, website. So highlights, uh, probably the best uh, oil-free sheer tinted SPF ever. And it's like a wearable natural skin illuminizing um, filter, like a selfie filter. Um, with SPF, with SPF 20 protection and sheer perfecting coverage. With EcoCert Squalane, naturally derived from olive oil to help limit skin dehydration. So you hear these words on your or like you read these words like on, like on the beauty website or on like sort of skincare products that get you know you know when you see an adverts for them and you think are those words real you know what do they actually mean so i've just had a i've had a look on the web and what the squalane squalane however you pronounce it what that actually does it's like a lightweight moisturizer and it's very sort of similar to your to your own to your own skin's oils it delivers the right amount of moisture to your skin that it needs so like it won't overdo the moisture and it won't underdo it um so it says it's got smoothing jojoba esters and soothing licorice extract and when i've looked that up the jojoba esters what they do they actually reduce dryness so you know sometimes when you can get like flaky or sort of rough patches of skin well the jojoba esters actually help to reduce that and it's supposed to um actually diminish the fine lines the appearance of like sort of fine lines um the licorice extract is like the soothing uh so that sort of soothes like sort of sensitive skin uh it can actually reduce you know like if you've got sort of pigmentation marks it can actually reduce that um helps so um improves overall skin tone as well so those are the key benefits of this like sort of tinted moisturizer um now obviously you've got a full ingredients list online so Please have a look at that yourself because I can't go into all of that. It's just too much. I'm just giving you the key ingredients. 
So that's been on, what, five minutes? And what I'm just going to do, I could just leave it at that, but what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go over the areas uh, that I normally like a little bit more cover. So I'm going to put a little bit more on, just that. And I'm just going to dab that on, I think. Yeah, I had this on yesterday and I put it on on the morning and really pleased with it like I am now and then I went out on the night time uh, and what I did I just did what I'm doing now I just actually just dabbed uh, a tiny little bit more on and I've got to say it lasted all day I mean so I probably put this on yesterday about 11am and then um I reapplied like as if what I'm doing now, uh, about a quarter to seven on the evening. And uh, yeah, it was lovely. And it's nice because you haven't got like any, because it's so lightweight, you haven't got like any sense of uh, having anything on. So I'm just going to work that extra down my neck. And because it's tinted, I want to make sure it's all it disappeared off my hairline. So that's I'm gonna put um I'm gonna put some makeup on, but that's really nice, isn't it? I like it. I mean to say that it's a sheer sheer tinted. Um, it's a moisturiser, it's not even a foundation, but you can wear this as a foundation. When I was reading on like sort of Beauty Pine, I was reading the reviews, you know, for this. I've left a review on if you want to check it out. Mine says, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm always understated. Um, and one person had put that she uses this uh, as a base and then she still puts a foundation on I suppose like if she's wanting more coverage so I mean you could do that I should probably try that and see how that works um, but uh, yeah so I'm going to um, put the rest of my makeup on and then I'll be back in a jiff so that's me with my makeup on and just briefly, what I've used on my face, I have used um, a light sort of dusting of, um, of uh, powder. But what I've used, I've used my Studio 10 and these are liquid, it's kind of like a liquid cum gel type formula. So it's a bronzer and a blush. And I thought that, I just thought that that formula would go really nice with it being you know, the tinted moisturiser. So rather than like a powder, powder blush or anything, I just thought it would give like a nice natural look. I forgot to say actually that this tinted moisturiser, it's actually suitable for all skin types. Um, it's all cruelty free. There's no testing on animals of any of the products. And uh, this particular one is made in a lab in Italy. I'm going to tell you a little bit about how sort of beauty pie works. So if you've got Instagram in particular or Facebook, you have probably seen lots of advertising for beauty pie. So with sort of beauty pie, uh, how it works is beauty pie is a buyer's club. You pay a membership fee and the membership fee now, they've just in the last few days, they've changed how the memberships work. So when I bought, I've had about three orders from them. And when I bought, basically the membership, you had a yearly membership, you could do a monthly membership, or you could do a £10 day pass. And because I was just like sort of trying the products out, I decided to go for the, temp, for the £10 day pass. Um, but when I've just checked before I've done the video, because I obviously wanted to get the prices and everything, they've actually changed it all. So what the current membership is now, it's £59 for a year. It's called Beauty Pie Plus. 
And basically with that, you don't have a monthly spending limit or anything like that. You can just buy the products as and when you want. Now they do put a cap of 3,600, but if you wanted to spend more than that, you could do and you just let them know. And they're like, when I did my first order, I'd gone over my spending limit when they had like the spending limits on and it cost me five pound to get an extra 50 pounds worth of products. Now, when you are buying the products, for example, so this uh, moisturizer, the tinted moisturizer, when you go online, the typical price, what you have is in the pricings, you've got what they call a typical price and you've got a member's price. So, so the typical price is what you would normally pay for the product and then the members price is what you will pay as a member. You don't have to join Beauty Pie, you can buy the products without being a member, but you will pay the typical price. Now, so for example, the typical lab price of that moisturiser would be £30. The price to members is £8.30. And you might think, oh, how can they say sort of £30? Well, the labs that Beauty Pie use, they've got 59 labs and they are the world leading labs and they are in uh, UK, France, Switzerland, I'm just looking at my list, Italy, South Korea, and Japan and USA and these are the labs that luxury brands are, are actually made in. So all the products are luxury. Now I have got all the beauty pie skincare now as you know i have been using like sort of charlotte tilbury for the last year or so and i love charlotte tilbury but it's very very expensive but it's really lovely quality and i've got the full range of like sort of cleansers now with like you no know, with like sort of beauty pie i've got the full range of cleansers moisturizers everything and it is really high quality. It really, really is. You can feel it on your skin. You know the difference between a cheap moisturiser and actually one that you can actually feel the quality in. So basically what they're saying is that, that all the products are like, they are the equivalent of like sort of luxury brand products. So that on that 3,000, like sort of 600, that would be what the typical price would be. Do you understand? So the typical price, would, so you get, you know, sort of 3,000, like sort of 600 pounds worth of spend a year for your 59 pound of the typical price. Um, I hope that is like sort of clear. On my last order, um, on my most recent order, I paid like sort of 75 pound, I got loads of stuff. Um, and the typical price would have been about 330, something like that. So that's where it's that's what your spending limits are based on. So basically, for £59 a year, you can have £3,600 worth of the typical price of luxury products. And um, what they've got, they've there isn't that 10 day, uh, 10 pound day pass, but what they're doing is because they've just gone over onto this. They're doing a 60 day, at the moment, as I'm recording this, they're actually doing a 60 day free trial. So you can try out the products to see if you were gonna be happy. And if you're not, if you're not happy, if you're not happy, you know, you can just like sort of cancel, you can like sort of cancel, you know, the membership. Um, I'm just gonna read you where it says. So, on the on the Beauty Pie Plus free uh, trial for 60 days, this is if you're shopping for the first time. What this is, it's only, you're only allowed one uh, trial per customer because if you want to go back and shop, then really you should become a member. So on the free trial, you get free delivery on your first order, no catch, cancel any time before the trial ends. Your full membership, 59, what well it says here, it says here dollars, but I think it's 59 pound. Your full membership of 59 pound will activate after 60 days. Don't worry, we'll remind you before if you want to opt out. So you basically, you're buying direct for a lot less. 
Uh, once you uh, start your free trial, you'll instantly access our unbeatable membership only prices. No catch, no commitment. Unless you fall in love, which happens a lot, it says, as I've done. I'm totally, honestly, I'm obsessed with beauty by now. You can cancel any time during your free during your free year trial and your official membership will activate at the end of your free trial. We'll remind you before if you want to opt out. So that is a lot of information to take in. Um, another thing on the Beauty Pie website, you can book a free consultation uh, for makeup or for skincare. I did this for my skincare. Customer service at Beauty Pie is absolutely brilliant and um, they're so helpful. I booked um, I, I booked a skincare consultation and um, I'd, I'd, I'd like sort of sent in, they'd ask me to send you like a, a form, you know, beforehand, they email you a form and you fill out information about your skin. If it was for the foundation and things, you'd be filling out about what products you normally use and everything. And I also sent a photograph of me, you know, for me it was a skincare, so without makeup. And um, and then I had a lovely consultation with a, a, a lovely lady, told her what I was using. She then recommended me, based on, on my Charlotte Tilbury stuff, she then recommended me products that she thought would be very similar, you know, to give the same effect. So it'll be the same if you had a foundation thing, but the cust if you had a foundation consultation, but the customer service is absolutely brilliant. So um, for me, it's a thumbs up for Beauty Pie. <laughs> I hope that that's all been really uh, clear. As I'm speaking, it sounds very complicated, but it's not. And if you go on to beautypie.com, it will become very evident. If you've enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't en enjoyed the video, you can give me a dislike, entirely up to you. But it means a lot to me to obviously to get like, you know, the feedback with the likes or the dislikes. I don't think I've had any, any, any dislikes yet. I don't think so. Um, and if you would like to subscribe, I would be really grateful for that. And um, have a great day, whatever you're doing, whether you're watching in the morning or the afternoon or the evening. Have a great rest of your day or evening and I will catch up with you in my next video. Bye.